Okay, so today I'm going to be making a tincture oil um, with the calendula flower and with the chaga. This is a fungus that grows on the side of a birch tree. We gather this. I've, I go chaga hunting every other year and um, find this. It is hard to find, but it's a pretty amazing fungus that we can drink and use. And like I'm going to make a tincture with it today, so you'll take that every day for however long you want to take it and it's really good for you of course it's got many medicinal properties as with the calendula as well this has great medicinal properties for people as well uh, so here's the calendula flower here this is what they look like when they're growing in your garden they're a beautiful flower and they have such a nice aroma too they grow in yellows and oranges um, so what we're going to do is, like, we've got them filled about halfway, and they're still feel pretty good, so we want to take our vodka. You can use different kinds of vodka. This is just the one that I chose for this time. I am still learning a lot, so this is how I'm starting. Now, I'm not sure that this is where I'll be in another six months or a year, but this is where I am right now with making these chaga tinctures and these calendar, any kind of tinctures I've made. So that looks like the chaga's absorbing that. You just want to fill them so they're just over the herbit itself you have in the bottle. Just give it a little stir like that. You want to make sure that you can see that it's getting down in there and that all the chaga is covered. See, now i got to put a little bit more in there. And I'll put a little bit more in here as well. Yeah, that looks really good. And yeah, that's starting to float, but I think I'll just put the rest of that in there. Okay, so I'm going to take these and I'm going to label them so I'll know the date that I made these. And then in six weeks is the what I've been kind of researching online to give an idea how long you should let them sit. Some people say a month, some people say uh, six weeks, so I think I'm just going to let them sit six weeks so I know for sure that they're absolutely good. And then in six weeks time, I'm going to have two amazing tinctures that I'm going to take every day or every other day. And I hope you find this video very helpful. Thanks so much for watching.